during our Lenten mission, we've journeyed at Archbishop Gustavo's invitation along a path of hope, bringing together a communion, a unity that embraces our many parts. And I hope we found along the way that, that this communion, this community, isn't that we all become a single note, or even a communion that would cram us all into a single chord, but rather a, a resolution, the resolve of a beautiful melody that is Christ Jesus. And all the notes that by themselves might not make sense when we come together into that single melody, we find a power and beauty and a resolve. As we finish the Lenten portion of our journey, we now start the days of Triduo, and we'll see that tonight that resolution still eludes us. As we said in the garden, Jesus dragged off to Caiaphas' house. Even tomorrow in the great love and the passion and death of Jesus, the resolution isn't yet there in death. And Saturday, as we sit in the empty church and feel the empty, we still haven't found the resolution. It's only with the lit Easter fire of resurrection, each of us with our own candles burning brightly, listening once more to the notes of salvation history, that we begin to come together in the communion of our baptism and of our Eucharist. And tonight already, we'll celebrate that communion as Jesus washes our feet and washes away our sins and invites us to be one with him.